The lineage of Gangneung Seonggyojang originates from founding ancestor Wanpung Buwonggun, who was a descendant of Hyorongdaegun. The family lived in Cheongju until its fifth generation for 200 years, then moved to Gangneung during its sixth generation, in which Ga Seondaebu and Linnebeon became the first ancestors who lived in Gangneung. Legend has it that he was guided by a group of weasels to the current site, which was known as a Gilzi, an auspicious place. As the Gyeongpo Lake was right in front of the house, a bridge to cross the lake was built by connecting boats. That is how the name of Bridge Seonggyojang came about. In the early days after moving to Gangneung, he built Ju, the main house, and stayed there. But as poets, artists, and the culture people of the Joseon dynasty who traveled around Gumgang Mountain and the eight famous sceneries in Eastern Korea gathered at Gangneung in flocks, the construction of more buildings continued for 100 years, during which Yeolhwadang, Pyeoltang, Jungsarang, Hengdangche were built. The current scenic view of Seonggyojang as an ideal one with mountains at the back and water in front. This was achieved by building Hwallaejeong and the pond and by planting lotuses in 1816. As the biggest house in Joseon outside the palace, it is said the family's generous hospitality towards guests, their humility despite being so rich, and their good care of tenants farmers accumulated virtues in the heavens for the family, and therefore the houses remained in good condition until now. In response to the government policy of revitalizing old house heritage monuments as tourism resources, these buildings became open to the public to pass down and share the culture of Seonggyojang and to further spread create and use them as resources for national interest. There are some spaces to enjoy Korean traditional food, snacks, clothes, and some other programs. And also, you can stay in Hanok, which is Korean traditional house. For more details, please check below. Thank you for watching. 다음에 또 만나요. 안녕!